What you guys got another video here for you a malicious backdoor has been found in linux red hat on friday released an urgent security alert warning that two versions of the popular data compression library called xzutils it was previously known as lzma utils it has been backdoored with a malicious code designed to allow unauthorized remote access the software supply chain compromise tracked as CVE-2024-3094 has a CVSS score of 10.0, which is indicating maximum severity. It's pretty much a really dangerous uh, bit of code that's been found there that is going to allow remote access to your computer. It impacts the XZ Utils version 5.6.0, and it was released on February 24th, and the 5.61 released on March 9th. The shocking part is that this is open source software, which means you can actually see the code, which means this was going undetected for a little while. Now, I'll leave links to all of this stuff in the video description. This is for the Wikipedia for XED Utils, and also the Hacker News website has posted an article on it. There's quite a bit of information here. Uh, to go through i'm not going to go through everything but this one here is explaining exactly what this is and how severe it is and what you should do and you can read all of the description here where the malicious code was discovered in the upstream of tarballs of xz so you can see all the information that has been published as of yet i think it's still under investigation and they're still trying to find a resolution to the problem that is for this backdoor issue. And you can see that the base score is 10.0, which is the highest you can get, and it's critical. It's a pretty bad one, uh, to be honest. And uh, if you are using Linux, then you can use the links in the video description to read more about it and see what you can actually do to address the issue. Now, this site has also added some links uh, for more reference and, and more information about this issue. And you can click on some of those links, and it will give you a lot more uh, information about what the problem is and how to address this issue and it is quite a bad one uh, to be honest so you might want to click on this and you'll see down here all the hyperlinks are listed right here to all reputable sources so this is not clickbait or scamming people this is actual a real bad issue that needs to be addressed now you can see here there is another site here which is on the red hat website and you can see malicious code was discovered in the upstream right here as well and again this is the guy that i think actually found it he's not a malware analyst but he actually breaks it down and shows you exactly what he found and how he found it and again you can check some other youtube channels out there that are dedicated to linux and they might be able to give you some more information on it but all the links in the video description will go through exactly what this problem is and the best approach uh, to deal with it i don't think there's anything you can do as of yet uh, but I do know that it's still under investigation and they're still trying to work out the best possible approach to try to remedy and fix this issue. Anyway, with that said, I think that's just going to be about it for today. I hope you're having a lovely Easter. I shall catch you in the very next video. My name has been Brian from brightechcomputers.co.uk. Bye for now. <music>